Hello everybody and welcome back to some more Lord of the Rings Online. We are here at the Court of the Fountain at the top of Minas Tirith and uh, we have made our way up finally after jumping off the edge and I feel a little bit more knowledgeable about this place now. Uh, as of recording this, the night before this video goes up, um, I spent the time on my main to go across and around every single bit around here um, and you know, find, you know, I completed all the deeds, um, you know, like finding all the, uh, like all the stewards and all the kings and stuff like that. For example, if we go in here, we use this, we'll get a nice deed of like 33, I think it is. Uh, 25 of these, 33 of the kings, I'm pretty sure. So let's have a quick, like, double check. Yeah, so 33 of those, and then you got to find all the stewards and the, yeah, the stewards, line of kings, it's a bunch of stuff. So I just spent all my time doing that. So, I'm a little bit more in tune with this area now, um, so we're hopefully going to use that to our advantage. Before we get into anything though, we have our Hobbit gift of the day, so let's have a, a little brief look at this. Rare Madam Hunter's armor, that's fine, we have been uh, sort of clearing up our inventory just a little bit as I have previously shown. Uh, we have three people to talk to. Looking at the map, we have one down here and we actually have two up here. Actually, possibly not even two. You're just a captain that I've got to talk to. And you are Peregrine Took. Ah, it is good to see a familiar face in this city of strangers. Okay, pick up the picnic lunch from the Thirsty Seer in the southwest section of the Fifth Circle. We're going to be going around a lot, I have a feeling, a lot of these areas. Um, so there's one there. It was one further down here. Uh, at the guard. No, that's the guard of the citadel. Then we've got the council of Gondor. Authantir. So he seems like he's going to be there. And then we'll have this one down here, which is uh, probably Duelin. I would have thought he's in the soldiers tier. He's talking about discipline. That kind of feels like that um, relates. And then the council of Gondor on, like, I guess the sages tier would this be? No, this is the master's tier. I guess it kind of relates. Um, so we need to go talk. Yeah. Go down to here where we're going to go to the Sages tier. Essentially, it's go backwards from what you previously did, except this time you can actually, like, run around. So you're here. I'm not going to worry about picking up these things as Welcome well. I'll do those all separately one day. The council of um, enter the Dome of the Sun where the Council of Gondor holds its meetings. Dome of the Sun. Basically, today is just going to be get familiar with Minas Tirith. Model of Minas Tirith. That coughing is putting me on edge. The model of the White City stands in the center of the room. Don't know if that was part of the deed or if that was part of the quest. Yes. Ah, I wonder if you might do me a favor. Ooh, are you alright there, man? You're jumping over. So we need to collect some, ga or gather the scattered papers, scribbled notes and such. We want to collect eight of those. There seems to be four sets of tables. Well, four sets of two tables each. That's one on each. That makes sense. So we're just going to be making sure we obviously go to the right place. There's actually, this one has a bunch on. So I guess this one is just the better to go to. Then you as well as our final one. Bring the scattered papers over to this guy once again. I am nearly ready. Let me copy these down. Okay, I'm wait for Orador to finish writing the council's resolutions. So we just have to wait for a minute. I guess we can just have a look at the model then. You do not have the corresponding quest. I mean, that is a pretty cool, like, while we wait... Just as a general being able to have that just here is really cool. It just looks really cool. Normally I'd be like, I'm wasting time here, but I literally am. That is the point of this whole exercise. 28 seconds. It's like when are we waiting for your legs to not be damaged anymore after jumping off something a bit too tall. Um, but when we do that, when this one completes, we will head down to the uh, the fifth circle and also get, after that, completing uh, in need of discipline. 
I have a feeling it's going to be collect the picnic lunch and then go back up. So we might go do that, then talk to Doolin, then do that. He looks up from his work. Hello. I need someone to bring these resolutions throughout the city. Okay. So, uh, Torchon, uh, Erkadon, Selafir, and Muradil. Uh, the warden of the stores, the warden of the coffers, get up to the garrisons, and warden of the houses of healing. Uh, so, those names, not necessarily the names, but the places seem familiar. So, hopefully, we can find ourselves here. I think it's good that we, uh, you know, did that. Uh, to like familiarize ourselves because otherwise it's going to be a bit difficult. What I am going to do, I'm going to clear all or clear all just so I can specifically only see map like uh, quest location things because Mistreth is, as you can see, very well populated with stuff so I don't want to get too confused. So we will eventually be going up to the top anyway to complete this one and this one. We can get a stable master. I might just throw stable masters on just so I can find them. But we should quite easily be able to find, yeah, the Houses of Healing. I don't know if we're going to have to go in them. As you know, I am the Warden of the Houses of Healing. Well, I know that now. So, there's that one. Then there's going to be this one. We might as well just jump down and complete this one. Uh, and then... Players tier. Players tier? Is that right? That seems like a really weird name for it. Or maybe I'm just misreading. Hmm. Interesting. I guess if I find my stable master, I can go talk to the stable master and see what I it's the called. Warden of the stores. Okay. It's a difficult responsibility. So, I'm going to see if I can just sort of jump down a level. I'm going to injure myself, but I think it's going to be quicker. Okay, you can't jump off. That's a little annoying. Tad, tad bit annoying. Uh, so, let's get on our steed then and head down. I did just notice we're very, very close to getting... Well, we're on the last sort of quarter or fifth. One, two, three. Yeah, I guess fifth um, of the level, so we should be pretty okay. Now, I think it allowed us to jump down here, so at least we can do a bit of skipping uh, stuff. I mean, I don't know if it's better for it in the end, because we are still going to be damaged by, um, you know, our wound from falling, but I don't know. Makes it feel faster, because at least we're still moving. Then we gotta come all the way around. Then back. Then we can probably just catch Stone Master down two levels, because we don't need to go anywhere else after that. And then, once we've done, talk to you, see what you want us to do. We'll probably have to head back up here anyway for the last bit of the resolution, plus also uh, the picnic. Then that'll all be good. And then, uh,. Yeah, we can do these, skip up, complete those quests. Uh, Gandalf's also up there, so we should be able to complete that as well. And slowly but surely we are also getting a few of the Discovery Explorer bits done as well. And uh, we've also got some farms to pick up later. In the Blue Theatre. Is this right? Why do I feel like this is wrong? Or is he outside? I feel like he's outside more than in here. And I'm stuck. The Thirsty Seer. The Fifth Circle. That's not the Thirsty Seer. Or is that it? Select all again. Yeah, the thirsty seer is up there. Why is it giving me such a big? Okay, we'll 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 fix that. We'll quickly go up. It's pretty quick to get 
from the Master's tier to the Thirsty tier. Let's even get on our war steed just to show we're, we're serious. It makes it really look like it's on this level. I guess if I read it a little more, then it might have made more sense. Right. Stable Master. Where are we going? Sages. See, I realized I had to go to the Masters instead of the Sages, because then we can get just a bit closer. And I am perfectly okay with spending an extra 20 silver, which is easily, easily made back. Just doing that. So, then... We should just need to go this way. Houses of Law. And uh, we don't even have to go inside, just outside. Now, my question is, is this going to be a... Okay, we're carrying the picnic lunch. Carry the picnic lunch to the watch point at the end of the pier at the top of the city. It wants us to go all the way to the top of the city. Okay, this is going to be a fun one. I mean, I said it was going to want me to take it to the top, but I didn't realize it wanted me to take it there. Also, a funny little interesting thing, probably not funny, but at least somewhat interesting to me, um, is the fact that... Uh, it's this way, isn't it? Um, it's the fact that I apparently hadn't done the deed to jump off the edge uh, of the pier, which confused me, but also uh, that I died when I jumped off, even on a war steed, but when I uh, jumped off with this character, I didn't die. I don't know why. I thought maybe the deed, like, would shield you almost somehow, but no, it just doesn't. I was just lucky, I guess, either that or I didn't register. It's like sometimes you drop, like, nothing and it gives you, like, a minute of weight, and then sometimes you drop from, like, a fall-off cliff and you've got, like, six seconds. It's a little bit weird. So, we just jump, well not jump, but head straight ahead. We can yeah, walk over these, we don't have to really worry about anything there. It's an easy up and down sort of thing, as long as we don't auto run off the edge. Then I think we're good. Oh, that time it caught us. So we're going all the way up here. Paragon took. Hey, it's our picnic lunch, and everything looks delicious. Do not be shy, my friend. Let us dig in. It's his favorite tavern in Minster Earth, apparently, and I can see why. Well, don't be shy. Let us dig in, and let us. Uh, we will talk after we have taken the edges from our appetites. So we're going to eat some food and drink. Apparently drink some food as well. There we are. Why did we come here? Well, Gandalf thought... Well, you see... Uh, uh. He thought I should see Master Earth. It's all the others had their own plans, and you know, he's a wizard. Eat some more food. Easiest quest ever. Most relaxing quest ever. It tastes very good, but you're becoming worried about Pippin. You set the brew, it refreshes you. The food tastes fine enough. I wasn't entirely honest with you, and I'm sorry for uh. it. There's an artifact at Isengard, one tongue threw it down from the tower and came to do some harm to either Saruman or Gandalf. And I saved it from rolling away into a pool. Gandalf claimed it soon afterwards, but not soon enough. I found I could not stop thinking about the Dark Globe. I stole it away from the wizard when he slept and looked at it. I saw, I saw, Pippin trails in silence, shame and fear written upon his face. I saw a tall tower and a black sky and wheeling shapes. Oh, well, that is 
not great. Was that the Palantir? I think it's the Palantir. Clean the picnic up and put everything away. And with that, we can go talk to Peregrine Took and finish his quest before heading off to... We can give the resolution to the one we need at the top here. Let's put our filters back on. So we can give up this... Uh, what is it? The Council of Condor. This one here. Then go back down to... Well, go to the soldiers tier. And... Uh, give this in. Do that one as well. And see what they want us to do. And then we'll probably go back to the Dome of Stars. I think that's what it's called. Um, to give in the quest. There may once have been good reasons for using such stones. But no longer. Okay. So not as much XP as I would have thought. I would have thought there'd be a few more, like a little bit more than 72k, but that's fine. Now we want to go down here to you. There we are. Thank you for bringing this resolution to me. I there we are. Upon it at once. So we have one more resolution to give in, which is as I said, going to be on the soldiers tier. So we will grab once again the stable master. I will sort out. That is, I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> Completely the wrong way. Uh, to do this way? Here it is. Uh, so we'll go down this way, get to the stable master that's closest, and then. Oh, turning is such an awkward thing on this. Then we shall. Um, yeah, finish this like, final bit of resolution thing, which is going to complete that whole quest up and then we shall uh, go do the other one as i said probably 20 times now and if it wasn't that obvious right soldiers tier here i go these are troublesome times uh, indeed we are. okay where are we on the soldiers tier okay roughly the middle right then straight on our war steed ahead we go Sort of ahead, we have to go to the side, but it won't take long for us to get there, especially on the war steed, and it's relatively, at least for the moment, relatively um, clear. Like, you don't have to do too much dodging and stuff, it's pretty easy. So, you, I want to slow down a little bit, turn this corner, give it to you. I am the captain of the garrison. I take my duty there we most are. Seriously. Talk to uh, Parthadan, well, one of the green in the southeastern section of the sixth circle. Up there, the master's tier. That should be fine. So we'll talk to Duelin first. Is he going to be in or out of here? Seems in. So let's find you. Hey, I found you. My brother and I have been teaching the folk here how to bring down a Mumak. Okay, we need to collect some arrows. Have you seen our father around the city? Bring the black arrows to do in inside. Okay. So we need to talk to a Duin here atop the hall in the second circle. We're in the second circle, I think, already. I think we are. Yeah, so it's near the Stable Master, which is almost perfect, but I have a feeling we're going to have to go there and back, which is less than perfect. I think we should be fine, except from the fact that Ministereth is still having to load in, which, if it's stuttery, that is why. Either that or I keep opening the map constantly, but... Uh, that's not where I want to go. I'll be around here. I'm surprised that worked. I'm surprised I'm not being rubber banded back. Alright. Straight ahead. Okie dokie. Where are you? You're going to be up here. I don't think I can accidentally jump off, so I should be good. 
My sons must learn to obey my words, or there will be no okay. sons of mine. <laughs> Collect two bows, three swords, and two shields. Where from? Just around. Okay, that's fine. That's an easy one. I'm facing the target. What are you doing to me, game? Alright, there's got to be more to it than this, I have a feeling. Bring the black wearer in. Uh, oh, so he's gone to the place. Okay, let's get on our regular steed. So he's gone to the black group. Um, well, Lord Duhan and the black group Vale went to the Mummican. Uh, keep Evan at the tavern in the second circle of Mistress to reprimand his sons. Duelin and Derefin left Mistress without their father's permission and now they have returned. They want to make amends. Okay. You guys can do that. As long as he doesn't shout at me. <laughs> I think we're good. Trying to work out now how many quests till we level up. It's less than 10, because 10 is going to be like 720,000 XP. Is it half of that? Like maybe, maybe like six quests, something like that. If I'm just going off 70k, something like, yeah, six, seven maybe. So really, if I'm completing four today, I definitely won't be that far off. And and furthermore, uh, furthermore, <laughs> Duhan uh, do stares at the mugs of Mumak, seemingly to see it for the Can first I time. I try. I will show you how this is done. I warrant. Do you see? There is nothing to worry about after all. Okay. We all good. We all happy. Now you're just showing me, showing how to shoot a. A mummock. That's fine. I'm I'm happy for you. <laughs> Just we good. So now, now onto our final, sort of final one, where I walk with the horse. This is my favorite animation. Not quite working. I was about to say the horse is properly spawned, but because of the um the antlers. But it's just my bow that looks like antlers. Right, though, we need to go to our stable master, head up to the master's tier, where not only is this dude, but also the quest that we are going to be completing. And then we'll head up to the top, complete that, and be ever so closer to this. So we should be yeah, about 305k XP away from leveling by the end of this quest. I have a feeling this quest might give us a little bit more, just because it's a main epic quest thing. Um, but you never know, it could just be 72k. I thought I ran past the stable master. Where am I going? Master's indeed. tier. Alright, is that who I want to talk to? It looks like it. Parthenon. Which reminds me of the word Parthenex. Alright. This place is really difficult to navigate sometimes just with the camera. Warden of the Green. As the Warden of the Green, it is my duty to preserve the townlands. Now who am I going to? I'm going to... I might as well go here. Craftsman tier. It's getting expensive. Gondor needs your aid. I mean, if you look, those two... travelings there, use up more than what we just got rewarded. I mean, I don't know how I'm going to be able to keep up. Yeah, you know, I'm so low on money. <laughs> oh, I can't actually jump straight off there because that probably would kill me. We need to be a bit more. A bit less silhouette. I wonder if I can hoop up here. No, okay. Damn invisible walls. Okay, bring the grim report to Thal here in the northeast section of the stone circle. So he's the warden of laws. Um, 
Parthadan gives you a grim report of the situation in Palinor to show to Thal here. So where do we find the Warden of Laws? In the Hall of Laws. Well, just outside. What is this? Um... Okay. So bring this report back to Ar Arador for... Okay, so that seems to be quest-ish. Complete-ish. Sort of. We'll, uh... We'll head up to this, obviously, then we'll head up to uh, the Master's Tier, head over there to the Dome of Suns, give that in, head to the top of Minas Tirith, and then give in the quest, most likely to Gandalf, I think. I think that's how it works. Wow. I'm going too far over. Well, nearly. Who'd have thought you could spend nearly half an hour just riding around Minas Tirith on three quests. But to be fair, it would have been quicker if I went to the right place. Right, where am How I going? May I help you, friend? Master's tier. Boom. So now, if I don't get stuck, which I nearly just did, all we should need to do, get on our horse, ride through that tunnel, Back to the Dome of Stars, I think it's called. Yeah, Dome of the Sun, rather. I mean, I'm not quite that far off. The sun is a star. And then go talk to this dude. The Chief Scribe. Thank you very much. Those resolutions will help safeguard the city. And that's that quest complete. Now we've got to talk to Mithrandir in the Court of the Fountain. Not quite a quest completion yet, though. So I wonder what else he has in mind for us. But as I said, that gets us to 305k remaining. Uh, I need to... I'm going the wrong way. I need to go around this way. To then get up to the Citadel. Through here, I think. Hey, look at that. Getting used to it. Okay, I did get the angle a little wrong. But the location was pretty much pinpoint accurate. Right. Mithrandir! The White Wizard. It's great, so in the legendary cell we just met the brown wizard, and now here we are with the white wizard. Um, the Prince of Dol Amroth is looking for someone to undertake a mission of some danger, and I suggested you would make the ideal candidate. Hurry down to the first circle and learn if Imrahil has already sent someone else. Talk to Imrahil, the first circle of Mr. Rift by the gate to the city. That seemed like a perfect time to jump off the edge again. <laughs> Let's do that. Let's do it. It was fun last time, it was fun, it'll be fun this time. Worst case scenario, I know for a fact now the retreat point is in the city. So I think we need first person, F12, running straight off the edge. Almost. It's the watch point. Way. <laughs> it's the city wall. I'm sorry. I'm about to land on your head. Hey, dude. How are you doing? Let's go. I mean, that was easy. That's a lot quicker, I think, than everything we were about to do otherwise. Um, obviously, it means we died, but, you know, I'm not fussed. This is a bit of fun. Now let's talk to you. Mithrandir said you would be happy to undertake this errand. Okay, so we're getting the agility morale and the uh, box of two essences one. Go to the north gate of the Ramas and learn why Ingold has not come back. Okay, okay, that's good because we kind of needed to go to the north gate anyway for part of those deeds. Um, there's a warden over there that you have to talk to specifically, and that's the one that kind of 
confused me and I actually go to the wiki to sort out and find out where he was. Uh, so that's good. I know that how to get there sort of thing. And also it helps us with the farms, which is like, there's one like here, there's one like here, 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 and then there's one here, one here, one here, one here. There's like eight or seven, seven, eight or nine, one of those three. So yeah, that, that should be good. These are all of the annoying tree, right? Yeah. I, I would have thought there might be like a, like a set bonus, but I guess not. Um, nonetheless though, that shall be it for today's episode. Uh, a lot of running around, but we are edging ever so closer to the level 109, which is going to be a bit of fun. And uh, then we can see if the rare Madam Hunter armor is starting to keep up or not. If not, we'll stay with what we have, but it's not doing a great job at keeping up at the moment. So that'll be it for now. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.